know until you know if you can qualify or not. So you might as well find out if you can qualify. And if you can't, what are the steps we can get you to qualify? We'll figure out your credit score. The biggest thing we'll be looking at is debt to income ratios. When a mortgage company pulls credit report, there's three scores. We're gonna use the middle score of the three. We're gonna be looking at the minimum pay payment and also the payment history. Bad things we're looking for, late pays, charge offs, foreclosures, things like that. The good things we're looking for are consistent on-time payments. 85% of the ones we do are 30-year fixed loans. They're people have been doing them forever. They're basic loans. Everyone can understand the payment doesn't change over time. There's also other loans. Uh, there's shorter term fixed loans like 15 year or 20 year. There's adjustable rate mortgages. And there's also specialty loans like construction loans as well. They're typically a short term loan while you're building the house. The loan is actually in the customer's name. The builder, they'll take draws, construction draws against the loan amount. And when the draw comes through, we'll reimburse them the money for the draw. They'll pay interest only on the outstanding principal of the loan. So it doesn't amortize, amortize like a, a normal loan, it's just interest only loan. Your payment goes up slowly over time as the builder draws and eventually when they're done with the project, you turn that into the permanent loan. A bridge loan would be borrowing against one property, gonna use that money to borrow against another property. And eventually you would sell the first property and pay off that short term loan. Builder financing, the house is still under their control. You're not making payments. They're basically footing the bill while they're building the house. Work with someone who has their goals in mind. It's just not a rate. It should be more of a planning for life thing, like a financial consultant would be just on the debt of a home versus an investment portfolio.